Hello friends. This question is from the subject of informatics series 5 in the subjects of networks and the topic name is sinusoidal steady state analysis. Okay. In the problem we have an RC network and two ampere two emitters A1 and A2 are connected with their respective branches. Now question says that the emitter A1 reads current 5 ampere. Okay. The emitter A1 reads current 5 ampere and question asks that you, you need to calculate the current A2. You need to calculate the value of the emitter A2 that you need to calculate. Now you know we know that it's a RC network. The pure RC network the in the resistance R current is with the phase of the voltage. If I draw the voltage, uh, voltage reference phaser if this is my voltage reference so across the I resistance if I can assume this current as a I1 across the capacitor if I can assume this current as a I2 so my I1 will be with phase of resistor because resistor across resistance current always have a with phase in phase with the voltage but across the capacitor current always leads with the capacitor with a 90 degree it means that across the capacitor my current I2 will be have a 90 degree phase difference with voltage V or I can say that my, my component I2 has a 90 degree phase difference with component I1. It means that my overall current I, my overall current I will be equal to the under root of I1 square plus I2 square. Right. So the, so the RMS value of the I is 13 because its magnitude is 13 root 2 which is peak value and uh, Vm. Now if I want to calculate the VRMS which will be Vm by root 2 which is 13 by root 2 or 13. So my 13 will be equal to the I1 times. So I1 time, I, current uh, value of I1 is given which is 5 ampere. It will be 5 square plus I2 square. I2 is what we need to calculate. So just square the both the sides. So your I2 will be equal to the under root of 13 square minus 5 square or it will be 12 ampere. So the value of current I2 will be 12 ampere or my answer will this numeric data will be 12. Thank you.